How's it going guys? Topic for today's video, how to turn any MP3 file into an audiobook file, which is also known as a .m4b file. So the reason for doing this, you might you might, you know, download maybe an audiobook or something like that and it comes in a .mp3 file or say you download an audio from YouTube of say like a lecture or a speech and maybe it's like an hour or 2 hours long and it comes, it comes to you in a .mp3 file. Why would you want to convert it to an audiobook file? Like what's the point of even doing that, right? Um, so with, a, with an audiobook file or considered a .m4b file, what's great about it is that it has a bookmarking ability. So if you listen to say the first 31 minutes of your audiobook that's in the .m4b file, when you come back to it and you listen to it again, what it, what it does is it remembers where you left off and then it'll start again. So say you have a two hour long .mp3 file and you listen to the first 30 minutes and you come back to it, it's going to start at the start. Um, so it's not going to remember exactly where you were before. So that's one reason why I really, really love having, um, having audiobook files, so .m4b files for when I'm listening to any type of, uh, any type of audio file that's, you know, of significant length. So how can we convert an mp3 file into a .m4b file? So there's going to be some uh, some programs that you're going to want to look into. Uh, for the Mac there's a program called Audiobook Builder. So what you do is you select a cover image um, for your audiobook or for the lecture or whatever you're listening to and you for the files that you want to convert into an audiobook file. So you just uh, you select a cover image you input either a single mp3 or a collection of mp3s so you can have chapters and then you just basically hit the create button and it'll create it in uh, create those files either that single mp3 or the collection of those mp3s into one single audiobook file and then you can just load it onto your onto your uh, mp3 player or into your smartphone and then you can listen to it as an audiobook and it's really really nice um, it's something that my buddy Ted and I got into uh, when I was living out in Vancouver and for some like I love listening to audiobooks so it's really really um, it's really it's a great little tool to have now if you're on the PC um, you want to I research a couple programs even though I haven't used them is there's one called AAC audiobook creator so I'm guessing that this kind of works the same way I don't have a PC to test it out on um, so what I would do is if that one doesn't work very well, just type in audiobook creator for PC in a Google and you can try some other programs as well. But definitely try it out. Um, a lot of people know that you can download um, YouTube videos and have them converted into MP3 files. So when you do that, um, you can convert it into an audiobook file. So there's, you know, sometimes here on YouTube you can get, you know, one or two hour lectures or seminars or something like that. You can download it into an MP3 file and then um, have it converted into a audiobook file or a .m4b file. And you can download those videos into MP3 using a website called Clip Converter. And uh, that's a great little website just for, you know, converting YouTube videos into MP3 files. Awesome. If you guys have any questions or comments, definitely leave them in the box below. Awesome. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Talk to you soon. Peace out.